Dean, uh, obviously getting the session in today before, uh, before the team flies, uh, you know, how's it all looking on court? Yeah, it's an interesting world we live in right now and, um, you know, a little change of team that we were going to play and, um, you know, fortunately we've been able to play them in pre-season and play them early in the season so far, so it's, it's not a team that we have to, um, you know, start a new scout on um, and they, you know, they played pretty well up in Brisbane the other night, so, um, yeah, good to get a session, good to get prepared for um, this road trip and, and have all 15 guys on the floor today, which is fantastic. What's it been like um, sort of in the preparation? Obviously you have an extended period off and then you think you're playing against Cairns and now you've, you've got two games against two opponents you didn't think you were going to play against. So how does that factor into preparation? Oh, I think the way professional basketball is at the moment uh, all over the world, you've got to be dynamic and, and go with the flow. And so you change a couple of things here and there in terms of preparing for specific teams. But uh, New Zealand's a, one of the form teams at the moment. They had a great game against Brisbane and, and we're, really, we're really looking forward to testing ourselves against them and then following on that, going to Illawarra on Sunday. Mm. And uh, you know, you talk about the talent on their team. You know, having a full healthy group back with United obviously must be really exciting for the whole group and, and yourself. You know, what's it like to be getting these games under your belt with a full group and, and really being able to see the potential of this team? Uh, yeah, I just think it gives us a chance to show how many guys we've got on this team that are talented and, and capable. Um, you know, getting Jack White back was a huge boost for our group, CG a couple games earlier. Um, with the full squad together, uh, it allows us to sort of show how we play well together and, and we're building that chemistry and the more games we can get in together as a group will, will help us going forward. But now that everyone's back together, you know, we've already seen a, a few different lineups thrown out there. How good is it for you as a coach to have that flexibility to, you know, throw, you know, different combinations out there and, and keep other teams guessing? Yeah, I think they're the rewards that, um, you know, we strive for every week if, um, if someone on our second unit is, is doing their role extremely well and outplaying someone consistently on the, on the starting group, then, then they, they should be able to, to get to start if, that, if we, the team believes you know, that's the, the best thing to help us get a win. Um, so you know, we've got a good competitive nature, but you know, people's roles are fairly well established right now uh, in what we need from them. Uh, it's just at which time of the game do we, do we put different groups on the floor and um, obviously having Jack White come back recently, that's, um, we've seen some adjustments there with him playing both power forward and small forward spot.